everyone, this is Ellen with Artifacts, and today I have a little sneak peek inside my own personal artifacts collection where I want to show you how you can easily create an artifact that includes audio and video that you record directly in the app. So look along the bottom, in the middle you see plus artifact. Notice that the first two are actually recording options. Take a photo or video, record audio. The second, excuse me, the third and fourth are for existing content that might be on your phone or tablet where you're working. So in this case, I'm gonna say record audio and click record. So as I'm talking to you right now, you can see the microphone jumping up and down. That's just indicating that it's processing what I'm saying and recording it into the app. I'm gonna click stop. And now you can see the fun little ups and downs of my vocal recording. I could play that back. I won't do that. Probably sound pretty strange on this um, recording. I can save it to my artifact because I'm happy and ready to go. Or I might save it to my device if I'm not happy with it and want to record it again, but don't want to lose this copy. Now, what would happen if I recorded something that's too long to fit into my artifact? In that case, I would also get other options where I could trim it, I could compress it, or again, save it down to my device if I prefer. Now, in this case, I'm gonna say saved artifact. And you'll see you're right here, as usual, in your artifact form. At the top, you can see the little audio icon that tells you it's been added. Now, I would add my name of my artifact, as usual, and continue filling it in. Notice that next to the audio, you still have, just as usual, that plus icon. I could tap that, and again, it'll give me the same options. Take a photo or video, record audio, add existing. It's that simple. We hope it helps you. And off you go. Enjoy artifacting.